you. A discovery from Colorado Springs is getting attention from around the world and it has to do with scientists who study fossils. Yeah, there's been a gap in the Earth's history from 66 million years ago. Well, this discovery brings evidence to that missing link in time. Bill Holson back from the Denver Museum of Science and History. That announcement, the discovery announced today. Here with a closer look at what's this being called unprecedented, Bill. Yeah, this happened at Corral Bluffs, which is just east of Colorado Springs. It's an area that's been searched many times over the last 100 years. Two paleontologists with the Denver Museum were there not finding much. And then one change of thought led to that unprecedented discovery. Corral Bluffs, open space on the edge of Colorado Springs. Now a fossil find shows a link to history from 66 million years ago when a massive asteroid hit the Earth and unleashed a wave of destruction. Brought the age of the dinosaurs to a fiery and cataclysmic end. The end of the dinosaurs is also the beginning of the mammals and plants from just after the destruction. We knew very little about how life emerged in the first one million years after the end Cretaceous mass extinction. We made this big discovery right on the edge of Colorado Springs in an area called Corral Bluffs. Two paleontologists from the Denver Museum of Nature and Science, along with a team of volunteers, went to Corral Bluffs hunting fossils. No success changed quickly with a shift in thinking and action. The aha moment was when I picked one of these concretions up and cracked it with my rock hammer and opened it up and saw a mammal skull staring back at me. And I was floored. A million years of Earth's history with a lot of unknowns, suddenly with complete skeleton skulls and fossilized plant life. A complete game changer, a paleontological trifecta. For the first time, we were able to document the recovery of an entire ecosystem right after Earth's last mass extinction. Yeah, all that from right here in Colorado Springs. For three years, this has been a need to know secret. Today, it was revealed with a publication in a prestigious science journal. Also today, an exhibit opened at the Denver Museum of Nature and Science. Rob.